Right guys, I'm going to talk about some warning signs when investing in people. Right, so I was at a games convention and somebody introduced me to somebody who was looking for some investment. Guess what the guy comes over and says, Hi Shaz, my name is blah blah blah, nice to meet you, blah blah blah. We get chatting and he's telling me about his games company and how he's looking for investment and that. And then he starts telling uh, me and my friend about how good the lobster was last night and how the, the five star hotel he's staying in is uh, pretty awesome and he's glad that, you know, he's getting to stay there and, you know, he's never stayed in one before. And, you know, now he needs more money to keep the games business going. And you know what I thought to myself? Oh my God, this guy's making a massive mistake. He doesn't realize that if his game studio is worth a million dollars and somebody has given him like $250,000 or a group of people have given him $250,000 to expand that, he's the majority shareholder. He should be using that $250,000, right? to get that game studio up to like 2 million valuation or 3 or 10 or whatever because every time he gets a gain on that studio he's making the most money but guess what he's doing? He's wasting his money he could have stayed at a clean 3 star hotel for 25% of the cost he could have not ate lobster and I bet the lobster he ate was not at like a normal restaurant I've got a feeling he will have went to a Michelin star restaurant. He'll have looked up the best restaurant in the area and he might have even took guests, right? Because he was using the money as a free bank account, not as his money. He was not seeing that that 250,000 or whatever was given to him for him to expand his business and add value to the investors, increase their wealth and increase his. Right guys, what you're gonna realize is when you get investment or when you invest in somebody, I'll do it from perspective of when you get investment. You've just had $250,000. You know what? The investors have probably got another 10, 20, 30, maybe 100 investments like me, right? You know, that money that you've just got, that's the only investment you've got. As in, that business is what you're giving your 100% to. If that fails, you lose everything. If it fails on the investor's perspective, they've lost a tenth or a hundredth of their wealth. So don't squander other people's money because it's not other people's money anymore. It's your money. Once they give you it, it's your money. Don't die average. Stay happy. Like and subscribe. See you next time.